In this video, we are going to talk about how to configure your BoxCaster to a wireless internet connection. Setting up your BoxCaster to a wireless connection can be done in a couple simple steps, but let's go over some key points to start. The first time you configure a wireless network, the BoxCaster will need a hardline internet connection. You cannot connect the box to a wireless network that has a login page. Start by plugging your BoxCaster into a hardline internet connection via Ethernet. Next, make sure you see the green cloud icon before continuing. Once your BoxCaster is online, log into the BoxCast dashboard and go to Settings. Click on BoxCasters, then Edit. At the bottom of the screen, you will notice the Wireless Configurations area. Start by unchecking the box that allows the BoxCaster to hook up to a public network. This will ensure that it is connecting to the network you configure. Once everything is loaded, click Add Wireless Networks to find the signal you'd like to configure to. After choosing the network, you will be prompted to enter a password. Be sure that all punctuation and capitalization match or the BoxCaster will be unable to connect to the network. Once that has been entered, click Save Changes. If all the information is entered correctly, then you will see a green box appear informing you that you're connected to the Wi-Fi network. If you do not see the network or need to connect to a network at another location, click on Connect to a Network Not Shown Here. This can be helpful if you're trying to connect to a wireless signal that you do not have access to at this time. To give you an example, a lot of our sports clients do this when they have a wireless connection out at their field, but not a hardline connection. Thanks for watching, guys. If you have any other questions, don't hesitate to reach out to questions at boxcast.com or click on the link in the middle of the screen.